Hello, people. Welcome to um, my redstone vault system using the repeater combination lock type thingy that Seth Bling used, or at least showed me in his video. But um, anyway, I, 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 uh, well, I spent quite a while trying to get this to work. It, it's pretty simple. It's not complicated, but um, ticks just don't seem to like working properly in Minecraft, unfortunately, which, um, and the upshot of which is that two and three read as exactly the same thing for some reason. So I could do the same combination like that, which is, um, it, it decreases the number of combinations you can have. It's a bit annoying, but, um, I haven't found a way around or solving that problem yet. But anyway, I've got a very simple example to show you here. I have four, um, volts and, um, I am going to just open the first two to demonstrate to you. This is my vault. This is Sespling's vault. I made him a vault using his passcode from his video. So, um, yeah, so let's see. Can I remember my code? My code is, what is it? Is it, um, yes, it's one, one, three, three, two, four. That's it. Except that it's really one one two 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 three, but um, yeah, but it it doesn't matter. It re it really doesn't matter, to be honest. Um, if you can find a way of getting around that problem, then please let me know. But anyway, I'm just gonna very quickly gonna enter that code and Wah! I'm in. And let's see, that's that's my iron doors. There's a little button here. It's an escape button if you get locked in just to be sure and four large chests obviously if you want to make your own or do a version of this you can make the vaults much larger but um i i, I just really I, I i didn't need to so i mean four large chests is, it's, a, it's a lot of storage anyway but um other than that let's see let's cancel now and it should close the vault there done pretty quick now I'm gonna um, log into Sesslings um, Vault, which is one two three four one two three four one two three four. Yeah, um, he didn't pick a very secure passcode or account number. I suppose you could think of it as. Um, and I'm going to log in to that as well. It's just really one two two three one two. So let's go. And this should be Vault number two. Here we go. Um, Sesslings doesn't have any anything at all because he hasn't been in my world yet um no that uh, yeah let's let's cancel that let's close close this vault that's fine the enter button also does the same thing as the cancel button it's literally linked up to the same thing so it cancels the previous one before it opens the new one um which i think it, it's um a security feature right um so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to show to you that I'm pretty sure this did it last time anyway. Yeah, you see like that? That's um, the twos and the threes have all been switched around. I'm going to see if it still opens Seth Things account or whether that was just a random error earlier. Yep, it still does, see? But that's a bit of a problem. But um, I can safely assure to you that um, if I made this a four instead, enter, should close the door and then it doesn't open again, which, um, yeah, so, so it is, it is a proper combination lock. It's, well, I didn't really need to cancel anything there. Now I'm going to show you very quickly. It's, it's very small. It's very small. I was originally going to have doors here so you can come through and customize your, um, combination when you log in to your vault, but, um, there's just not enough space here to have that, a secure door, because these are secure doors. They are have been placed sideways, so um, you can't open them like that. Except you can destroy the blocks, so you just have to make sure no one can place and destroy blocks. Adventure mode, they call it, in 1.3, in which this will probably not work. Um, but this is a simple detector. It detects the pulse length. Um, this piston receives one tick to pul um, pulse, only if the um, pulse it detects was exactly the length of the button, which is 10 ticks. Um, one more or one less it it 
won't receive a one tick pulse. Unfortunately, because I've used inverters, because that's the only way of getting the signal out of these repeaters without interfering or making it much wider, um, that's why the two and the three appears to detect the same. This is the reset line, just pulls down and pushes up so any ones have been um, pushed but not pulled back up again do. So um, it feeds in the input through here, which um, goes through an inverter here, up, and the repeaters are behind this block. See, right there. And then they go through here, and every every third block they get sent up into these blocks, which are here, which feed these repeaters, which feed this line. And the, the line had to be one step up in order to avoid interference with the block here from the torches below it. And then the, to this modified version of the um, pulse length detector. And um, in order to avoid activating the account every time you reset it, or because this piston will push down no matter what, but whether or not the block stays down is um, what it detects. And so this thing detects how long it stayed down for. So that's why there is a slight delay. If, if, if anyone you, any, anybody can think of a better way of doing it, please let me know and I will try and make that. So that just powers the door and it that's it. It's simple, you can have as many as you like because it's all repeater based. You can extend this to as many volts as you want. Obviously I have to walk up and down quite a lot. You can install a minecart ride. But um, other than that, it's um, you can also make the combination longer. Since you've only got three digits, the um, number of combinations is um, down fourfold, I believe. But I'm probably not doing the math correctly. I should be able to do the math correctly. Um, so 15, you can have a 15 long combination of one to three, which is it's better than 15 levers-ish. Well, only a bit better. I think, yeah. I mean, effectively, you're squaring, I believe. Are you? I'm not sure. You're um, you're increasing it by a power of something or other. I'm 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 really not sure. I, I I'd have to stop and think about it. But anyway, that's pretty much it. It's very simple. You've seen it there. Um, yeah. If anyone else can do a better version, I'd be very impressed. And please send it to me if you do. So cancel reset the thing thanks for watching this is the um, first minecraft video i've done in a while and since i've got some new hardware and software it's working a lot better and a new computer that i must mention so i look forward to doing some more um yeah i just wanted to show you it, it was cool so thanks for watching click the like button just for lols and um subscribe button just for lols if you really wanted to and um yeah. And that's it. Thanks for watching. Bye.